this problem, we have some results uh, regarding a drive-through restaurant. It says if one order is selected, find the probability of getting an order from restaurant C or D or an order that is not accurate. So we have an addition rule problem, and the way to know that is the keyword or. So we never have, whenever you have an or, it's an addition rule problem. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and copy down the table over here. So we have accurate, not accurate, what a nice color, A, B, C, D, good stuff. So 326, 37, 278, and you don't have to write down the table. I'm only doing it just to show you something really, really cool. So 143 and 20. So we want the probability of this, C or D or not accurate. So on the bottom, we have to have the total, right? So let's go ahead and figure out the total first. So to figure out the total, you add everything up. So 326 plus 37 plus 278 plus 54 plus 236 plus 38 plus 143 plus 20. So 1132, that's the total, and that always goes on the bottom. So 1132. Okay, so it's an addition rule problem, and we know that because of the or. So what does that mean? Well, whenever you have a table and an or, all you do is circle and add. So we go to restaurant C, and we circle the restaurant C's. Or D, so we circle the D's. Or an order that is not accurate, so we circle the not accurates. You'll notice some things are circled twice. Uh, no worries, though. You only add them once. So after you circle everything, then you just add everything up in your calculator. So you add up everything that's circled, and that goes up top. So 37 plus 54 plus 38 plus 236 plus 20 plus 143. Beautiful. 528. So whenever you have an or and a table, just circle and add. And that number goes up top. And then on the bottom, you have the total. So the answer is 528 divided by 1132. And looks like it wants three decimals, so 0.466. So 0.466. Let's try it, see if it's right. So 0.466. All right, we got it right. That's it.